to this special multiplayer DVD version of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Your chance to try your luck in that famous hot seat and compete against your family or friends to be the first to reach the magical million pound mark and the chance, of course, to win a family holiday to Universal Mediterranean. Now, all you need is your DVD remote control. You can move around the screen and make your choices by using the up, down, left, right and enter buttons. It really couldn't be simpler. Right, if you're ready, let's play. Right, here we go. Let's go over the rules, although I'm sure you're familiar with them all by now. You are 15 correct answers away from winning a virtual million pounds. Now, as always, you can walk away at any time. And if you do get stuck, then you have the usual three lifelines. There's 50-50. You can phone a friend, or of course you can ask the audience. OK, if you're ready, all you need to do now is select the number of players, and we can play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Right, you have 15 questions and three lifelines. The very best of luck, let's play. Okay, for 100 quid, here's question number one. That's absolutely correct, well done. Have a look at question number two, it's worth 200 quid. Very good, no problem at all, right answer. Here's question number three, it's worth 300 pounds. Only play this if you want to, you don't have to. Congratulations, that's the right answer. Remember, a wrong answer here and you will leave with nothing. I'm sure that won't happen. Question number four. That's the right answer. It's going really well so far. Now, get the next question correct and you'll leave with at least a thousand pounds. Good luck. Here comes question number five. Why not have a drink while you mull this one over? So, you decided to ask the audience. Well, now let's hope that they can help. Audience, on your keypads, please. All vote now. That's absolutely correct. Well done. You've reached the first milestone. That's £1,000. Now, have a look at question six, because it could double your money to 2000 In which sport was Sue Barker a leading competitor? Athletics, golf, show jumping, or tennis? Well played, that's correct. Here comes question number seven out of a possible 15. It's worth 4,000 pounds. Good luck. 
which is not a denomination of euro banknote. 5, 10, 100, 250. That's the right answer. It's going really well so far. Okay, if you choose the right answer to the next question, you can double your money to £8,000. Let's have a look at question 8 of 15. Which word is used in the Bible to describe any people who are not Jewish? Infidel, Goth, Gentile or Heathen? Okay, you've decided to use your phone a friend lifeline. Choose the friend you'd like to call, but remember, you do not have to go along with their answer. C didn't strike me as correct at first, but now I think about it. I'm afraid to say I'm stuck. I'd probably guess at C if I had to. Well played, you're absolutely right. Right, the jumps are starting to get a lot bigger now. Here is question nine for a possible £16,000. Which of these US presidents was not assassinated? William McKinley, James Garfield, Abraham Lincoln, Ulysses S. Grant. No problems there, that's the right answer. Okay, this is where the drops start to get steeper. Get the next question wrong and you lose 15,000 pounds, but get it right and you win 32,000 guaranteed. A basic physics equation, pressure equals force divided by what? Speed, area, mass or volume? Right, computer, we need a bit of help here. Take two of the answers away and hopefully make things a bit easier. That's absolutely correct. Well played. Right, question number 11 is worth £64,000. You would still walk away with 32000 even if you got it wrong. But let's hope you don't. Which character was played by Honor Blackman in The Avengers? Vena Smith, Kathy Gale, Tara King, Carol Wilson. That's the right answer. It's going really well so far. Right, the next question is worth a whopping £125,000. It's number 12 of a possible 15. Take your time, it's a lot of money. Which Zurich Premiership rugby union team are known as the Sharks, Saracens, Leicester, Sale, or Northampton? Congratulations, that's the right answer. Right, now just take your time and relax. The next question is number 13 of a possible 15. If you answer and you're wrong, you drop back to 32,000 pounds. Here's the question for a quarter of a million. Which is not a nickname adopted by a member of Girls Aloud, the winners of pop stars, the rivals? Kimbo, Casper, Pouts or Paddy? Well 
played. You're absolutely right. This is now getting very, very serious. You are just two correct answers away from winning one million pounds. But if you give me a wrong answer here, you will lose 218,000 pounds. Not good. Have a look at question number 14, but think very carefully about what you want to do. Which motorcycle company celebrated its centenary in 2003? Norton, Ducati, Moto Guzzi, or Harley Davidson? I'll just remind you, you do not have to play this. You would drop. Two hundred and eighteen thousand pounds if it's wrong. That's absolutely correct. Well played. Fantastic. You have played a brilliant game so far, and now you have five hundred thousand pounds. But we would really like to give you one million. Take as long as you need. Here comes the million pound question. In Jude the Obscure, what fictitious name does Thomas Hardy give to Oxford? Christchurch, Christminster, Christtown, Christbridge. Well, you could have walked away with half a million pounds. But instead, you'll be walking away with one million pounds. That's the right answer. Fantastic. What a tremendous game. All 15 questions answered correctly. Well done. You are a virtual millionaire. Congratulations. Now, for a chance of jetting off for a fabulous holiday to Universal Mediterranean, all you have to do is write this special win code on the postcard provided and send it to us in the post. It couldn't be easier. Good. Well done and thank you for playing. Who wants to be a millionaire?